Danielle Collins versus Katarina Alexandrova, the second semi-final for the ladies Miami Open for 2024. And both players were not expected to make it this far. Collins started the tournament off unseated and will take on the lucky loser Pera in the first round. And after dropping the first set, fight back to win. 3-6, 6-1, 6-1. In the second round, she take on the 30th seed Potapova. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-2, 6-2. In the third round, she take on Avanesian, who had just upset Jabur, the sixth seed, in the previous round. But again, no problem for Collins getting through in straights. 6-1, 6-2. In the fourth round, she take on the 19th seed, Castella, who had actually been really good this time last year in Miami. But again, no problem for Collins getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-2 to advance to the quarterfinal. In the quarterfinals, Collins will take on Garcia, the number 23 seed, who just beat Osaka and Goff back-to-back -to, -back to get to this stage. There's no problem for Collins getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-2 to advance to the semifinal. Alexandrova entered the tournament as the 14th seed, and we did a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on Vekic. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-4. Third round, she take on Pavlyuchenkova, who had been very impressive at times this year. And after dropping the second set, Alexandrova would eventually win in three. 6-4, 3-6, 6-3. In the fourth round, she take on the number one seed, Igish Fiontek, who had just come off winning Indian Wells in the previous event. But this is no problem for Alexandrova getting through in straights. 6-4, 6-2 to advance to the quarterfinals. Quarterfinals, Alexandrova would take on the number five seed, Pagula, who had a bit of a resurgence this week. And after dropping the first set, would fight back to win. 3-6, 6-4, 6-4 to advance to the semifinals. These two have actually never played before, which is so random because they are the similar age, and you would have thought they would have crossed paths in their careers, but never faced off before, so it's going to be a first time meeting, and it's going to be a big hitting meeting as well, because they both hit very, very hard. Collins is going to win this one. She needs to use the crowd and get fired up. She was getting fired up against Garcia at times, but... She obviously didn't have to because she was winning so easily. She didn't really need to throw the fists around, but she needs to get fired up and keep that aggression that has been doing her so well this week. If Alexandra is going to win this one, she needs to serve well. And this is the first time she's actually playing someone in the last couple of matches that will be aggressive. So she's probably going to have to mix it up, maybe come to the net. She's very good at doubles, so she can do that as well, just to throw Collins off. Very fun matchup, very random matchup as well. Who thought these two were going to make the semis? But I've got to go with Collins in this one. I feel like Collins right now is just on something different. It's obviously a retirement as well, coming up at the end of the year. So the final Miami, she wants to do well. I reckon the fairy tale continues. She makes the final. But let me know down in the comments below who's making the final.